Hi, I'm Dr. Raphael Darvish with Skin Packable Dermatology and Cosmetic Laser Center here in Los Angeles, California. And today I'm going to be speaking with you about how to treat bad underarm sweating. With underarm sweating, there's a lot of good options uh, to treat it. Uh, obviously, you know about deodorants and antiperspirants. Losing weight is a good one if you're overweight. Um, and uh, using or wearing breathable clothing like cotton fabrics uh, as opposed to polyester or wool. Uh, will also help to decrease the amount of sweating. If those don't work, uh, then you have a case of hyperhidrosis or excessive sweating, and uh, there are treatments for that. The main best topical treatment that is used is called Drysol, D-R-Y-S-O-L. It's a 20% aluminum chloride solution that is applied nightly to the area, and generally that does a good job of making the area dry uh, during the day, and, uh, and it's probably the most commonly prescribed uh, treatment for uh, axillary or underarm uh, hyperhidrosis or excessive sweating. Uh, this next best treatment, uh, or really the best treatment um, for uh, underarm excessive underarm sweating is Botox. Uh, Botox is commonly used to treat facial wrinkles, but it, it, the other property of Botox is that it stops uh, sweating very well. It'll take a excessively wet, sweaty underarm and uh, make it bone dry, literally. And it works very, very well, very, very satisfying for the patient who has, uh, who has a situation in which they excessively sweat. Um, generally, when we do a Botox injection, we demarcate the area uh, of the treatment by using an iodine starch test kit. Um, it's a, a dye that reacts with the sweat, and it tells us exactly where uh, the sweating starts. Uh, so we can inject the Botox in those areas that uh, really are the most problematic. Um, beyond Botox, uh, there are surgical options. These are uh, like last line options because uh, they come with a lot of side effects. Uh, sympathectomy is a surgery by which a surgeon or neurosurgeon goes and cuts uh, the nerves responsible for uh, the sweating in the underarm. Uh, it comes with side effects such as excessive sweating in other parts of the body and other things that really uh, make it somewhat poorly tolerated. Um, there are other surgical options uh, available as well, uh, such as uh, cutting out the skin that is sweating. So actually physically uh, cutting out a sliver or a few slivers of skin and sewing it together and cutting out that that uh, that segment of skin that's responsible for the excessive sweating. Um, and then lastly, we have uh, pills. And uh, these are the anticholinergics. They are very poorly tolerated. Uh, most people really hate them. And uh, I don't have very many patients at all uh, taking the anticholinergics for hyperhidrosis because of all of its side effects. I'm Dr. Raphael Darvish, and that's a brief overview of how to treat bad underarm sweating.